Docker can be an extremely powerful platform for data science. To access a Docker container on our machine, we're going to have to use the command line. If you're not too familiar with the command line, a great way to get access to the directory that you need is through GitHub Desktop. Here we've got our, our materials repository downloaded. Uh, we'll sync it just to make sure that we have the, the latest changes. Right click and then click Open Internal. And what that'll do is launch a terminal that is located in that repository. Here we can see we have a variety of files and folders within this directory. You can see that with the ls command. We'll be using the data science notebook. To launch a Docker container, it's relatively simple. We'll use the docker run command. Minus D specifies that the Docker container is to be run in the background. Here we're specifying the ports and mapping those ports between the guest and the host. We're allowing sudo within this container, naming the container analytics dojo, and then mapping the directory on our desktop to the appropriate directory within the container. We're then specifying that the notebook should be, uh, should be started. If I execute that, it's just launched a Docker container. We can now access this Docker container through any web browser on port 888. Let's try that now. Here we see the Jupyter Notebook, uh, the data directory, as well as the notebook directory. Here we can select uh, just an intro to Python notebook, and we'll be able to access and run a variety of things uh, right here. That's about it for now. Just wanted to show you how to get started with the Docker container and how easy it is to use Jupyter Notebook.